in real life, a ditching like this for the pilot of a wrecked aircraft has often meant death by exposure and freezing. But now the RAF have a new immersion suit with which to cheat the sea of crash victims. Patty Victoria asked for a demonstration at the experimental station Farnborough. Here's what happened. Once aboard the dinghy, squadron leader Barwood reaches for the lightweight immersion suit which fits snugly under the collar of his May West jacket. It's made with a double layer of rubber with the object of conserving body heat in water. First produced eight years ago, it's the design of squadron leader Pass. The suit weighs only a few ounces, but it may well mean the difference between life and death. There's even a hood to keep his ears warm. The suit is inflated from the airman's mouth. Air insulation prevents the chilling effect of cold winds on wet clothing. Just to make things comfortable all round, there's also an air cushion for the man who looks a cross between an old-fashioned button-up hosted sofa and a man from Mars. Plugs allow water to drain away from wet clothes. Highly buoyant, a life preserver in itself, the suit has already passed tests at sea where the temperature was minus five degrees Fahrenheit. What's more, the airman can float or swim at will.